Hi, my name is John Jairo Marquinez and I am a student of Microcomputer System and Network. Today, I am going to explain the installation and operation of eTalk. This is the, the server machine. This is the client machine. After of the download of this program, I am going to run the executable file to initialize the installation process. The installation of this program is very easy. When the tall installation wizard appears, I am going to accept the term of the designs. Choose the installation location. Choose a tall master to use because this is the server machine. Wait for it to finish installation. When finished installing, I am going to run the configuration tool, which is Etol Management Console. I am going to use ACL Basset Authentication to authenticate users. After open it all management console, I am going to give click on authentication and on manage permissions. Now I am going to add the user account John and give it full control. To finish, I am going to click on apply. App set, apply, and yes. On the client machine, I have done the same steps. The only difference is that I am going to select the service and not master because this is the client machine. In this machine also I have an user account with the name John and with the same password that the user account that is the server machine. The authentication method is exactly the same procedure as I have done in the server. already I have in the server. Already I have installed and configured the client and the server. Now I am going to create a class. To do this I am going to give right click and click on add class After I am going to put the name of the class. To add computer to class, I am going to give right click in the class. And after, click on computer. Now I am going to put the computer name and IP address.
to remote live control the client computer I am going to right click on the machine and after click remote control Now I am going to send message to the client machine. To do this, I am going to right click on machine and after click and enviar mensaje de texto. To turn off the computer, I am going to give right click on the machine and after I am going to give click on apagar. And yes. This program allows us to control machine remote light and different functionalities.